In today's Your Healthy Family, we're following up on a new bill passed by the state legislature that allows dental hygienists to apply silver diamine fluoride under the supervision of a dentist. Dr. Fred Guerra in Colorado Springs says topical fluorides are nothing new. Topical fluorides have been around since the 70s and they've evolved. So they've had foam gels, they've had liquid gels, and now there is uh, more recent materials being used which are topically applied like fluoride varnishes. House Bill 1045 now allows hygienists to apply silver diamine fluoride even under indirect supervision of a dentist. Hygienists should be able to do this either, either supervised by a dentist because they have a dentist in their office or there are actually some hygienists that operate independently out in rural areas of Colorado. So it's, it, I think it's totally within their jurisdiction and professional ability to do that. Dr. Guerra points out the drawback of silver diamine fluoride is that while it effectively halts a cavity in its tracks, it leaves behind dark stains. It has the effect of really stopping or tending to remineralize as well. And that's why it's very popular in deciduous or baby teeth. Because even if it does cause some staining, we know that those teeth between the ages of the, let's say 4 and 12 are going to be lost. They have to let parents know that if they're using that particular fluoride that it's going to cause the teeth to stain. People that maybe are in nursing homes, Alzheimer's, they really can't take care of their dentition so it might be a tertiary measure just to prevent deep root decay. So while it's highly effective, it's not likely to be used much in high population areas. The downside is the staining and these days there are other products that are equally efficiently used in the dental office so you don't have to resort to silver diamine fluoride. If you have any questions, follow up with your dentist. For your healthy family, I'm Ira Cronin. For more health stories, head to yourhealthyfamily.com.